Hi friends, in this video we are going to discuss about SDFS, DFS, hyphen LS command in details. So let me go uh, to the help option. You can see there is a lot of option. Okay, if you do SDFS, DFS, LS, and then uh, hyphen D then this option will list all the directories in a plain file hyphen H is to do all the sizes in human readable fashion and hyphen capital R is for the recursively list the contents of the directory so let me do that stfs tfs hyphen ls let me show in my root directory you can see uh, this other file and let me go to mkd and do a list I am doing a simple list okay stfs tfs hyphen ls mkd you can see uh, this under mkd there is darby.log uh, file and under mkd there is a directory you can see its directory uh, kafka and here you can see under mkd there is a text file mkd.txt and another text file test.txt okay so this is a simple option i'm not using any uh, option here so let me use sdfs tfs ls hyphen d okay so here it is saying that directories are listed as plain files so let me do that you can see okay the whole directory is in a plain file you cannot see in details if you are using hyphen d and now let me use hyphen h sdfs dfs hyphen ls hyphen h you can see all the files are in a human readable format uh, when, when i was doing sdfs dfs hyphen ls uh, slash mkd you can see the size of this file was something 20119 okay you cannot identify whether it's a gb or kb or mb now once i did hyphen h you can see it is 19.6 kb okay to list all the spaced or the size of the file in a human readable format you need to use hyphen h okay so other option is recursively list the content of all directory so let me do that sdfs dfs hyphen capital r okay so you can see the difference yeah so when i was doing sdfs dfs hyphen ls hyphen h and mkd you can see there is one directory under mkd there's a Kafka directory okay you can see it's a directory but you cannot see the contain but here when I was doing SDFS DFS hyphen LS hyphen capital R you can see under the Kafka directory there's a file mkd.txt or test.tricks and tst okay so if you want to list all the contain of a subdirectory also then you need to uh, type hyphen r you need to use this hyphen r option to list all the content of your sub directories okay so this is how you can use stfs dfs ls you need to remember these options hyphen d hyphen h and hyphen r or for help option you need to type stfs dfs hyphen help and then the command name you need to mention
okay friends if you like my videos please don't forget to subscribe and if you have any doubt or any question please mention on the comment box thank you